Hello, friends welcome to my channel please subscribe. Let's start. A real-world range of more than 1,000 km is claimed for the new Mercedes-Benz Vision EQXX concept, which is 230 km longer than the EQS flagship EV. The sleek compact vehicle is the most recent in a long line of design studies that Mercedes-Benz has made public. It was designed to go against accepted EV principles as part of a program to develop fresh concepts, methods, and breakthroughs that will be applied to upcoming EVs. Marcus Schaefer, Chief Technology Officer of Mercedes, stated that the concept is a working prototype that even makes use of a current MBUX infotainment system. It makes use of the next-generation electric drivetrain, developed by Mercedes-Benz, which will go into production in 2024. The EQXX is said to break a record for aerodynamic efficiency, with a drag rating of less than 0.18 cd, despite meeting all current German roadworthiness rules and having room for four adults. In comparison, the EQS measured 0.20 cd. With a low leading edge, a short bonnet, shapely fenders, and wide wheelhouses, the EQXX's front have a more sports car-like appearance. The digital LED headlights are joined by a full-width LED light bar, and the iconic Mercedes grille is replaced with a star pattern incorporated into the front bumper. Mercedes star insignia is stenciled onto the hood to reduce weight and maintain maximum aerodynamic effectiveness. Through the use of several air curtains and air breathers, the new concept car's front portion is said to have an air control system that conducts air through it. Additionally, Mercedes has added ninth-generation, external mirrors and newly created, aerodynamic wheels to the EQXX. Due to the absence of drivetrain components in the nose section, the EQXX's A pillars are positioned well forward, and its 2,800mm long wheelbase maximizes cabin space. The EQXX's rear design is influenced by the active aerodynamic advancements that Mercedes initially tested on the concept IAA in 2015. To smooth airflow and lessen turbulence at speed, a diffuser element is included. This device stretches automatically at speed. The rear track of the EQXX is 50mm narrower than the front track, adding to its slightly tapered appearance. The enormous 47.5-inch continuous display that fills the width of the dashboard is what first catches the eye of the interior. The display itself has an 8K resolution and serves as both the infotainment system and the instrument cluster, which is located in front of the driver. Mercedes has also made a significant effort to use eco-friendly materials throughout the interior. These materials include a silk-like fabric manufactured from biosteel fiber, vegan leather made from fibers found in mushrooms or cacti, and carpets woven from bamboo. The rear-wheel drive sedan's excellent efficiency rating, which at more than 9.97 km per kWh is nearly double that of the Mercedes-Benz EQS on the WLTP test procedure, is key to the exceptional range it achieves. It was accomplished by using a freshly created motor and a custom lithium-ion battery, whose overall energy capacity is less than that of the EQS, whose longest-range model can travel 770 km at slightly under 100 kWh. The 1,750 kg EQXX's new battery is said to be 50% the size of the 107.8 kWh pack in the EQS and weighs roughly 495 kg fewer thanks to cells provided by Chinese battery expert CATL. The new high-silicon battery, according to Mercedes, runs at a voltage greater than 900 V. Up to 95% of the EQXX's battery's energy, according to Mercedes, is transferred to the wheels. ICE vehicles, in contrast, typically function at an efficiency of roughly 30%. The 117 solar cells on the roof of the Vision EQXX concept automobile are used to power the vehicle's auxiliary systems. The solar panel by itself can extend the range by 25 miles over a day in perfect weather. The 204 horsepower new, small motor for the EQXX is housed inside a lightweight carbon fiber chassis at the back and is connected to a single-speed transmission. So do you like this concept? Hope you enjoyed this video. Please subscribe. Thank you.